everyone, Skyder from the Jim and Arch channel, and welcome back to Reigns Her Majesty Part 8. I don't know if I said what part this was in the last episode, but you know, this is Part 8. The last part was Part 7. So, yeah. <laughs> Professional. Desdemona. If I'm butchering these names, I'm sorry, but... Yeah. Anyway, um, I still have not completed these three things, and they're starting to annoy me. Le Le English. Latoya died famously, forever an icon to disobedient women. Uh, Queen does- wait a minute. Have I been mentally reading that sentence wrong this entire time? Because I've always- This entire time I've been thinking forever an icon to disobedient women. I was thinking that meant like misogynistic, don't- uh, if you're not obedient sort of thing. I don't know if that sentence made any sense, but I don't know. Just ignore me. <laughs> Queen Desdemona takes the throne to high acclaim. Legends of her beauty eclipse all news. Okay. I long to prove my strength and loyalty. Let's have a battle tournament in the Queen's honor. Wait, what? Are you asking... What? Are you asking to duel me in my honor? I guess? I'm not quite sure I understand what just happened. We acolytes need silence to do our sacred rites. Will you build me a tower in your palace? Okay. Oh, a cat. Okay, follow the cat. You follow the cat around the palace until she falls asleep in a sunbeam. Hopefully that doesn't mean she exploded. If you, uh, play or watch Subnautica, you might get that reference. Um, some relics I discovered were actually church property. Oops, can you help me pay the fine? Uh, no, because I don't want to go broke. Bye, this is Woozy. My sweet queen and dearest friend, happy 20th birthday. How'd you know I was 20? <laughs> it would be your lady's honor to throw you a celebration. Uh... Please do, I guess. Wait a minute! You said it was my 20th birthday after I'd been in power for five years. So that would mean I was... I became queen when I was like 15 in the game's logic. Okay. Um. Great. I want to be able to see our enemies from afar. The palace needs a new tower. That costs money. Astrology is evil. You can only gain insights by talking with God. Um. Whatever. I can all get on. Ah, oh, fuck you. Emily, the 20th queen. Holy fuck, there's been 20 queens. Wait a second, I want to do some math. Okay, so the first queen became queen in the year 999, and the previous queen, or this queen actually, um, just became queen in the year 1214. So, 1214 minus 999 is equal to 215, divided by 19... That means up until now, I have had an average running streak per queen of 11.3 years. Lovely. <laughs> Desdemona died famously, forever an icon to disobedient women. Queen Emily takes the throne following a long drought that has thrown the economy into chaos. Lovely. Oh, Queen, let us be true friends. Tell me, is there anyone at court whom you love in secret? Well, dot dot dot. Is it the brave explorer from far away? No. Is it your husband's master of the hunt? No. Is it the acolyte from the woods cult who danced hand in hand with you on your coronation? Uh, I guess. I mean... <laughs> 
We've already done this part. Wait a minute. I just realized we're starting to get into a territory where things are repeating now. That's going to be annoying if that's the case. Whenever you wish to discuss secret love, show me the royal perfume. That will be our signal. Okay. Maybe that was because I didn't uh, do that before. Maybe. It's like a romantic story. The acolyte who has taken vows of purity is the one true love of the forever queen. Uh... Love it. <laughs> what the fuck is with your voice? A lot of the country folk still go without work or wages. Shall we provide a stipend or invest in industry? Um... Let's go with industry. Ah, yeah, mucus. There is a pagan rebellion in the south. The cardinal wants our forces to join the war. Okay, you see, last time I did something, it kind of backfired on me. Because I didn't realize that the, uh, the acolytes were pagans. At least I think that's what happened in one of the previous episodes. I can't remember. This is the problem with recording a bulk of videos and then not playing for like a week or two. <laughs> um, not our problem. <laughs> what the fuck is with your voice, dude? <laughs> you sound like you're taking some kind of drug or something. The Crown has allocated funds this year. Wait, what? The Crown has allocated funds this year to invest in a new industry. Which one do you choose, my queen? Uh... I'm lactose intolerant and don't like milk, so I'm gonna go with honey. It's a it's a you dickhole! Wait, what the fuck? There was a there was a tiny sliver there. You can't lie to me. There was a tiny sliver there. I'm gonna go with honey. <sighs> fuck you. Wait a second. I just realized something. The um acolyte girl. I forget her name. Rosen. She said I can change my destiny with the star clock. If I use the star clock on the cardinal when I'm about to die, will that prevent it from happening? I'm going to try that, see if it works. What? So the longest I've lived so far is 24 years as Tamara the Matron. <laughs> Oh. You're welcome. Okay. Patience. Huh. I... I don't know why, but I didn't think you could name someone Patience. Although, then again, I guess you could name someone anything. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Emily died famously forever in icon to his beauty. Women, Queen pa uh, Patience's marriage celebration brings a period of national anxiety to a close. Wait a minute, this is the same king still, right? So that means this king has lived for 222 years now, Jesus, and has married um, either 21 or 22 different women. One, he's immortal. Second, he's a player. <laughs> Let us sell this prayer book bearing your image. You will earn a blessed percentage, of course. No. Uh, so it was you who stopped General Fonzie from marching with us in the south. Are you, are you sure your soul is safe? Are you sure souls are even real? Yes. My twin daughters are so rebellious. Instead of inheriting the family vineyard, they now want to craft honey. Um. So. <laughs> are you the devil? I guess not. <laughs> My queen, the land has been restless of late. Perhaps now is the time for us to study your security plan, just in case. 
Okay. Should some ruffian, ruffian come to seize you, pull the alarm rope, then grab your candlestick and wail away until the gods arrive. What a great plan. In case you couldn't tell, that was bleeding sarcasm. <laughs> okay. I'm going to ignore you. The church may build a monument to the new queen's virtue, if she is indeed virtuous, that is. Uh, I guess a statue doesn't really have any religious uh, annotations. Is that the word? Connotations? I don't know. Go ahead. It's an awful likeness. The people are rude about it. Oh, it doesn't look right. Okay. <laughs> they say the king of Northwest Isle is visiting the kingdom with his mysterious wife. Will you greet her? Sure. <laughs> oh. Severina. Nice name. Um. You are as beautiful as I've heard. Let us... Two queens keep company while our husbands parley. Sure. Eek, my queen, I just saw a figure sneaking below your window. It must be a ruffian coming to seize you. Fuck, was it a rope or a chain? Um. I want to say it was a rope. Now the alarm is sounding. Wait, why are we in like medieval times? How do we have an alarm? Oh, whatever. Do we have anything heavy to use as a weapon? <laughs> My scepter. Um, the candlestick. Oh, that candlestick. Yes, it'll be perfect. Ah, oh no. And now what do we do? Whale. It might not be the right kind of wailing. I'm not sure what you're insinuating. <laughs> Apologies, my queen. I was merely conducting a surprise test of our security procedure. How was our procedure? I'm doomed. <laughs> Your strength has made us a kingdom to be feared. I must guard you from our enemies at all costs. Really? I think I did this one before already, this ending. <laughs> eh, mucus. But seriously? I made our kingdom strong, and now I have to hide away forever in a tower. Great. You live some years locked in a tower alone. By the time you die, you have forgotten how to speak. Lovely. Well, shit. Anyways, I guess that's just about going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not subscribe and become a stalker today if you've never done so and fuck the like button. If you want to help support my channel, share this video with a friend so my channel can grow. This is Sky, signing off. Bye. <laughs>